how does it feel seeing your character evolve from the first movie to just like a guy just wants to get paid to where he is now? If there's a steady paycheck in it, I'll believe anything you say. Yeah, I know it's been great um, because it has been an evolution. You know, over the years, Winston has obviously moved on and done well, but he's still loyal and committed and uh, intrigued by the whole idea of ghost busting. Uh, he came into the franchise looking for a steady paycheck, and then he realized that these things are real, uh, as he said in the first movie. Now that he has the financial means, uh, he's sort of taken over the Ghostbuster uh, enterprise. Also, I think he realizes that the old guys are now the seniors and um, they will step in when necessary, but basically, he sort of uh, overlooks everything and he's sort of the Nick Fury of the Ghostbusters. Yeah, I like where the character is. I like his um, commitment to trying to figure out what the hell is going on. You know, if these things are real, if ghosts exist, who are the ghosts? I mean, are we talking about a grandparents here? Are we talking about some foreign thing? So he's willing to take his uh, wealth and influence and try to uh, look a little deeper into other than we're just running around trapping, you know, paranormal phenomena. Saying he's kind of like the Nick Fury is like a good way to describe it. Yeah. So does that mean like we're going to continue seeing Winston? Well, that's what I'd like to see. Now, what the studio has in mind, uh, I never try to predict what the studio wants, but I always say if they're smart, they would. Where do you want to see the Ghostbusters go? Yeah, I think um, Ghostbusters is definitely um, a New York story. I mean, uh, you know, it's, uh, New York is a character in the movie and, um, you know, there are ghosts all over the world. You know, ghosts in every culture, there's stories of, you know, ghosts. We're all experiencing this life, not knowing what's coming next. So I'd love to see it uh, go into some other cultures. There's certainly some of those old castles in Europe or certainly in Africa. There's all over the world. I'd love to see it sort of branch out. I'd love to see even possibly some different teams formed, you know. I think the heart of the Ghostbusters, you know, the humor, the mix with the, you know, the fear, it's, uh, I think having Winston being one of the originals and having him to continue to be a part of it would be, would be important, I think, to the fans even. I think the one thing I liked about this one was the roles weren't like cameos, you were like supporting. Yeah. So it's not like you're here for a second and you're right, gone. Right, yeah. Well, we know, we know it's time to, to bring in some, you know, the, just the, you know, three guys, but uh, it's time to bring in some new energy and, um, you know, and times have changed, you know, and it's, um, it's a natural thing. The new Ghostbusters, Frozen Empire, comes out uh, March 22nd uh, worldwide. I hope it does well. I hope the people will, uh, will embrace it.